On one side is Louis Pasteur, a Frenchman in his 50s and a chemist. Bravo. He's already famous for his work on germs and the conservation of wine. On the other is Robert Koch, a German 20 years his junior. <coughs> a totally unknown country doctor. <laughs> At this point, they have never met. Yet their confrontation will revolutionize science. At the end of the 19th century, epidemics were decimating populations. Tuberculosis, diphtheria, cholera, and the plague were still as much feared as they had been in the Middle Ages. What caused them? How were they passed on? Scholars were still stuck with the same theories. Heredity, insalubrity, or divine punishment. But some pioneers were putting forward a radical idea. What if the bugs that could be observed under a microscope played a role? Their intuition was right. Medicine was about to change forever. Microbes had been revealed as the agents that pass on epidemics. But who was behind this scientific breakthrough? For the French, it was the work of Louis Pasteur, while the Germans were convinced Robert Koch's research was key. Perhaps both of them, or was one against the other? What if their rivalry was the source of this revolution? 